in a pair figure skating competition a 65 kg man and his 45 kilogram female partner stand facing each other on skates on the ice if they push apart and the woman has a velocity of 1.5 meter per second eastward what is the velocity of her partner okay first let us make a, a real picture of the situation so this is the male partner and he's on his skates and right here this is me this is male so i don't have to make like here this is male right and right here is her female partner and he sees on another skate right here okay uh, initially they are at rest position like this okay so uh, uh, if they push apart and the woman has a velocity of 1.5 meter uh, eastward so when they push each other this woman move towards east with 1.5 meter per second okay so mass of this woman is 45 kilogram mass of this man is 65 kilogram mass is given and uh, velocity of this woman is given we don't know the velocity of this man right so neglect air friction we don't have to worry about the friction now first step of doing physics problem is identification so identify identify means what's given for example mass of man i can write down yum yum uh, instead of yum yum let's say mass of man is just yum one okay so mass of man is yum one which is 65 kilogram and mass of let's let's do other way suppose that mass of woman is 45 and mass of man is 65 kg okay what is the initial velocity of man and woman initial velocity of woman let's say b one knot is zero because they are at rest condition right and initial velocity of man let's say b2 naught this is also zero right no velocity at all they are just standing on their skates so what is the final velocity of woman v1 which is after they push each other the woman moves with the velocity of 1.5 meter per second toward east okay so what is velocity of man that is what we need to find out this is target variable okay our goal is to find the target variable which is velocity v2 of the man in this case okay so now second step is set off that is we have to find out the equation so to set off the equation let me write down the total momentum before they push each other so total momentum before they push each other the momentum of the woman is m1 b1 not right and momentum of the man is m2 m2 is mass of man remember and velocity we represent by b2 not right this is the initial momentum before they uh, push each other apart their total momentum is this one and remember this velocity and this total momentum is zero why 
because v one not look at here v one not equal to zero and v two not is equal to zero right so this quantity is zero and this quantity is zero it means total momentum before they push each other is zero what is the final momentum that is mass remains the same final momentum is v one m one v one for the woman and for man m one m two m2 p2 right so according to the conservation of linear momentum principle this momentum should be zero because this final momentum should be equal to the initial momentum because initial momentum is already zero so i can equate this equation to zero okay uh, if i insert values let me first write down like I have to find b2 so b2 m2 b2 equal to negative m1 b1 and b2 is equal to negative m1 b1 divided by m2 right so if i put all these values b2 is equal to negative of what is m1 m1 is 45 and velocity is 1.5 divided by what is m2 m2 is 65 right so if i calculate this one i will get something like p2 is equal to uh, 1.03 uh, meter per second right because this is the velocity negative sign is here okay so b2 is nearly equal to uh, one because this is i can neglect this one one meter per second okay this is the velocity of the man which is just the opposite direction of the woman because woman is moving towards east eastward and the man is moving backward that is westward so i can write down like p2 is equal to one meter per second westward right westward so we can write down in this form also okay so if i evaluate evaluate so this this was the execution right i have done these mathematics after setting off i insert a value so right here is starting from here i'm actually executing so this is the execution process and finally to evaluate this one look at here velocity b2 is the negative one right so it is re um, uh, reasonable because uh mass of woman is 45 which is less than the man which is 65 kilogram and the velocity of woman is uh, 1.5 meter per second and uh, mm, velocity of man should be less than that which is one it looks reasonable and also we get the negative sign because the velocity of woman and man should be opposite right so if this is, that's the case then we are getting right answer that's our evaluation